गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रन हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड हेल्दी एट योर प्लेसेस बिफोर स्टार्टिंग आर टूडेज वीडियो लेट एस रिवाइज वट वी हैव स्टडीड इन आर लास्ट वीडियो इन आर प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट नाउन एंड इट्स काइंड प्रॉपर नाउन कॉमन नाउन एंड एबस्ट्रेक्ट नाउन सो लेट एस रिवाइज दैम noun a noun is the name of a person place animal or thing so we can say all the naming words are called nouns here we have few examples of nouns man ram delhi honesty there are different kinds of nouns in your book there are only three kinds of nouns written common noun proper noun and abstract noun let us revise them one by one again proper noun it is the name of a particular person place animal or thing examples are delhi and sita so these are the particular names for place and person common noun it is the name of a person place animal or thing in general dog and city are the two examples for common nouns written here now next is abstract noun it is the name of a quality action or state which cannot be touched or seen examples are honesty and wisdom we can classify nouns into two types countable nouns and uncountable nouns countable nouns are those which we can count in numbers let me give you one example doll doll we can count in number like two dolls three dolls whereas rice is an uncountable noun because we cannot count it let us solve some exercises of your book first one underline the proper nouns in the following sentences there are two rules i had told you in our previous class first proper nouns always begin with capital letters second proper nouns means the name for a particular person place animal or thing so here we start with the first question my brother's name is abhijit here abhijit is a proper noun second I went to Agra to see the Taj Mahal. Here Taj Mahal is a proper noun and Agra is also a proper noun. Next Mumbai is in Maharashtra. Both Mumbai and Maharashtra are proper nouns. Sanjay is flying a kite. Sanjay is a proper noun. Next is John likes horse riding. Here John is a proper noun. Kolkata is a big city here Kolkata is a proper noun Sanya Mirza is a tennis player Sanya Mirza is a proper noun The sun is shining brightly Beta recall I had told you proper nouns always begin with capital letters so here sun is not beginning with capital letter it is not a proper noun Ashoka was a just king Ashoka is a proper noun people in West Bengal speak bengali here west bengal and bengali both are proper nouns some of you might be thinking why people is not a proper noun beta recall the definition as i told you proper noun is the name of a particular person place animal or thing so people is not for particular person people means log beta don't get confused you all are well aware that we write first letter in capital let us start our next exercise and circle the nouns and write their kinds first one i watch cartoon films on television here both film and television are common nouns as we don't have the particular name of film here and not the particular name of television also next is ranjit has only 5 rupees in his pocket here ranjit is a proper noun 
नेक्स्ट रवि वेन टू आगरा यस्टडे हेयर रवि एंड आगरा बोथ आर प्रॉपर नाउंस नेक्स्ट बुक्स आर कैप्ट इन अ सिस्टमेटिक वे इन द लाइब्रेरी लाइब्रेरी एंड बुक्स आर कॉमन नाउंस I have seen a cat in the kitchen here cat and kitchen are common nouns new delhi is the capital of india here new delhi and india are proper nouns it is good to eat green vegetables you know that there are different kinds of green vegetables like spinach fenugreek leaves here it is not specific okay so that's why it is a common noun One leg of this chair is broken. Here, leg and chair both are common nouns. The boy flew the kite high in the sky. Here, boy, kite, and sky are common nouns. A monkey is sitting on the wall. Monkey and wall are common nouns. Harbhajan spins the ball very well. Here, Harbhajan is a proper noun, whereas ball is a common noun. I rode a bicycle. down the street here bicycle and street both are common nouns dear children this exercise i had given you last time but the answers of this exercise can vary from person to person so here we will not discuss it dear children i had given you one more exercise to solve in your books underline the abstract nouns here we can start beta please check whether you have done correct or not if something is incorrect kindly correct it right now seventh the people want freedom in their lives here freedom is an abstract noun sushil takes advice from his friends here advice is an abstract noun confidence makes the people smart here confidence is an abstract noun i congratulated on her success here success is an abstract noun everybody wants peace in his life here peace is an abstract noun the sweetness in her voice makes all her friends so here sweetness is an abstract noun so all these things we cannot see or touch we can only feel them abstract noun is a noun of a quality action or state which we can neither see nor touch but can only think of that's all for today kindly solve question number a and b of exercise 2.1 in your book in very neat and tidy handwriting be safe and do productive things at your home thank you